Welcome into Campus Insiders. Bonnie Bernstein joined by our Michigan State Insider Joe Rexroad to discuss a very pertinent topic as we get closer to the College Football Playoff Committee unveiling its first poll. Joe, the Spartans' lone blemish on their record right now is a week two loss to Oregon in Eugene where they held a nine-point lead into the third quarter. Oregon, now a one-loss team, too, thanks to Arizona. So when you look at Sparty's schedule, the way they've played, the strength of the Big Ten as a conference, how in your mind does the Oregon loss impact MSU's viability as a Final Four team? Well, Bonnie, I think for one thing, Michigan State can say at the end, who else played a game like at Oregon in their non-league? And I think that's going to be a, a big point of discussion. But, of course, Michigan State would have rather seen Oregon rip through the Pac-12, win that, get their own playoff bid, and make that loss look better. Uh, on the flip side, the loss to Arizona means maybe Michigan State could actually pass Oregon in the pecking order. Maybe the Pac-12 can beat each other so, up so much that that could help Michigan State on the other side. But I still think Michigan State needs Oregon to play well the rest of the way. Obviously needs to finish 12-1. and one. If you want to talk about conference strength, the SEC is clearly ahead of everyone. Maybe the Pac-12 isn't as good as everyone thought. You look at some of the losses, USC to Boston College, some of the losses within conference. ACC and Big 12, I think it's SEC and everyone else. And I think if that proves true as we go forward, it helps Michigan State's case. Good stuff. Lots of folks are anticipating the Michigan State-Ohio State matchup November 8th as the game that will determine supremacy in the Big Ten. Joe and our Ohio State insider, Beanie Wells, debating that very topic. Check it out, only on Campus Insiders.